of work early in my uh, semi monster truck. It's actually funny because my whole family makes fun of me of the car I drive, but hey, it's the only thing that'll get me to the farms where I need to go to work. So, so you see, it's a bit of an adventure to get to the flower farms. And uh, <laughs> <laughs> you see why I need my my monster truck to be able to get there. <laughs> Okay, so we are here. Fresh cut flower farm, spring in the air. I bet you never thought you would actually come to a fresh cut flower farm. This is what they look like. So you can see here, these are the rose plants and uh, you can see these flowers are still very small. Today is uh, January uh, 30th, so uh, we're not going to have these flowers ready until Valentine's Day, actually, for, for you to enjoy. We're not going to cut them until like uh, the 10th or the 10th, 11th, 12th, and 13th of February, so that we can deliver right on Valentine's Day. Spray roses, that's what this means. A spray has got many blooms of roses on each stem. So, um, absolutely beautiful product that we're getting ready for you to go and give to your wife or girlfriend on Valentine's Day. Now I'm going to take you over to the cold storage, which is where we prepare our flowers for shipping. We get them hydrated and get them ready. Follow me. As you can see, all these bunches here are ready to go. These are orders that we've gotten today. Uh, yesterday for shipping today for people all over the U.S. And uh, this is an example of our uh, spray roses. This is how they would come packed. And uh, there's uh, 10 stems of spray roses here. And if you were to order the spray roses from springintheyear.com, what you get is four bunches of these in the box. So it's actually over 100 blooms of roses that you will be receiving. This is one of our uh, bunches of uh, green roses. The variety is actually called the green tea. And uh, this is what would come in a box if you order the long stem green fresh roses. As I was getting ready to come here this morning, I actually grabbed my daughter's uh, Minnie Mouse notebook and uh, I made some notes about what I wanted to discuss. So, What's really the whole point of this video? It's to help you make an educated decision when you come to buy your flowers. And uh, here's where I would ask you, what's the goal you have in mind when sending someone flowers? What's your point? What do you want to do? My guess is you just want to make that person feel truly appreciated and loved. But you're not going to accomplish that if you send them old flowers. Come over here now to the blackboard with me where I'm going to show you exactly what I mean by this. Here's what goes on in flower distribution in the States. What I call the old way is this. The flowers come from a grower in South America to a cargo agent, to a cargo airline, to a customs broker in Miami, to a Miami importer, to a refrigerated truck line, to a wholesaler, to a retailer, who then sells the product to you, the consumer. Now what we have developed here at Spring of the Air is springintheair.com. We are the grower in South America. We are actually in Colombia right now. We give the product to FedEx, and FedEx delivers to you. That's it. So we're gonna to talk to you about some reviews that we're getting on Amazon, and you're gonna see what I mean by that. Before I show you the reviews on Amazon, I wanna share with you a few pictures that I took last week on my last visit to the States. And uh, the idea is to show you what you will find in the flower stand at the grocery store. Now let's compare that to this. These are our flowers, a uh, picture that uh, customer of ours uh, sent us. I'll show it to you again. This or this. Um, spring in the air, grocery store. Uh, you decide. Now we're going to go over to Amazon. Here on the main search bar, you type in uh, fresh roses and see what comes up. Red roses, great for Valentine's Day. So you see we have all five star reviews. Take a look at this. Um, incredible quality and freshness in 24 hours. Uh, best gift ever. 
So this is our storefront here. And uh, look at our, our feedback history, and it's almost perfect. And I know that when you see a website that has just perfect reviews, then uh, that's not so uh, trustworthy, right? You almost think that uh, it's fabricated. Amazon makes it so that you can check and see where the reviews are, if they are true or not, and they are actual uh, verified purchases. And now we're going to go over to our website, which is uh, springintheair.com. And you'll see the beautiful website that we have developed for you. You go to shop now and you see the, um, the whole list of our products and availabilities. Add it to the cart and check out. Okay, there you have it. Real reviews from real customers from Amazon and from our own website, springintheair.com. Now, if you're the type of guy that just wants to wait till the last minute and go to your local florist or grocery store and buy some roses for $9.99, roses that are already dying, then uh, I do apologize and this video was not for you. However, if you're the type of person that really wants to make the special people in your life feel like royalty through the beautiful gift of fresh roses, then this video was for you and here's what I want you to do next. Simply place your order and allow us to do the rest. We will send the freshest flowers your recipient has ever seen and you will be delighted. And listen, regardless of if you decide to um, buy your roses from us or not, I truly enjoyed making this video for you. I hope it gave you some insight about what happens to flowers before you receive them. I do hope that you share your reviews about your wonderful experience with us. Thank you again for your time and I'll talk to you soon.